Hello and welcome, YouTubers. Alright, I got a very important question. I have my computer set up back here like this, but I'm not running this monitor here. I'm only running one. Right now I got the uh, that desktop computer on at this time. Alright, what I'm trying to have a problem with... Hmm. See if I can do this. Okay, let me push these in. Ah. Okay, I'm trying. I got my deal hooked up. Alright, go ahead and turn that monitor on. Okay, as you can see, it pulls down, down to 10 now. And here in a minute, this thing, the 750 watt power drive inverter, will beep on me. As you just heard, and it's only at 10, the battery dropped down to just 10 volts, as you can see. And computer's still on, but it's still only at 10 volts. I right, go ahead and hold that button and then turn the monitor off. Okay, as you can see, you turn the monitor off, this won't beep anymore. Alright, now I'm going to ask you to turn one of those big bright lights on. There's a switch on it, you, you'll find it. Just power it on, let me know when it comes on. The other one. One that should be plugged up already. Okay, the fan started to come on on that one. He's got that bright light on back there with just the desktop computer, not the monitor. Alright, now I'm going to tell him to go ahead and switch the monitor on. I'm just having my hand here holding these prongs into the deal here. Alright, go ahead and turn the mount monitor on. Give it a minute. Yeah, it's saying check video cable. It keeps coming up that, which I don't know why. It might be my battery, just not enough power. Did it come on yet? Turn that bright light out. And see what happens. Okay, now we're at 11. Okay, it's just not enough power. So anybody knows what's going on here? Okay, push and press hold that button again. There you go. But, uh... So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and crank it. And I'll show you everything, what it runs. Alright, it'll probably shut the computer off, but that's alright. Yep, they turned everything off. Alright, uh, take the uh, power button on top of the computer up under. Up under. Look up under there. Press it and let go. Ooh, don't hold it, just let There you go. Did it come on? Yeah. Alright, now turn the uh, monitor on. Same thing. So you can see what's going on. Okay, let's see what volts we got now. Hold that in there. We're at 12 volts now. And holding. Because the alternator's charging it. Keeping it at 12. Hit, uh, enter. <laughs> okay, now we're at 12 volts. We have no problem with it running. As you can see, now turn power the light on back there, the same one you did. Okay, now you, as you can see, you just heard it, the fan is on, on the power drive. And it just dropped down to 11 volts, kind of hard to see because it's getting darker out, but uh, there we go. Uh, we're down to 11 volts. 
So if anybody can tell me what's going on when the motor's not running, uh, do I need extra batteries, uh, what do I need to do? Please, anybody got any information, please go ahead and let me know. Uh, turn that bright light out. No, oh, wait, wait, wait. Why ain't that monitor coming on? Oh, okay, there it is. Alright, go ahead and shut the bright light off. Okay, as you can see, the fan is working. It just uh, turned the fan off and it jumped back to 12 volts, which that's good. But if I kill the engine, the computer won't run. Uh, you know, it just makes this thing beep. So if you can help me on that problem, uh, let me know. Alright, thank you for watching and bye-bye. Uh,